Hey YouTube, this is The Art of Prepping. Just wanted to show you a, a simple modification that you can make to uh, your magazines for your rifle. Uh, I'm doing it for an AR-15 build, uh, so these are for obviously uh, an AR-15. Uh, but you can do it for pretty much any magazine. Um, I'm going to be using some P mags from Magpul. Now all you need is some type of grip tape and some paper, a pencil, uh, scissors and that's about it. So what you want to do is basically just stencil out uh, the shape you want on the back side of your uh, grip tape and cut it out and put it on your magazine. Now what I did was uh, use the uh, the space and the shapes uh, that was provided on the magazine here as you can see on the right uh, uh, P mag and uh, there's some recessed areas there that I just basically filled in with the grip tape. Uh, the type of grip tape that I'm using is skateboard tape, but there's all different types. And so here are uh, both magazines finished. I basically did an application of uh, three pieces on each side uh, with this third generation uh, medium coyote tan uh, mags. Now, I also was considering uh, trying other different uh, P mags that I have in my collection. And so the one here on the top is a second generation P-Mag. It's actually in flat dark earth. It looks pretty similar to the medium coyote tan in this image, but they're actually quite different in person. So you can see here this uh, second generation flat dark earth magazine. I just started uh, putting grip tape on there. And uh, it actually turned out really well. Uh, super grippy. Lots of... Uh, uh, points of contact and you can see here uh, this is the final result uh, the lighting has changed in this image so it looks a little darker in the last but it's the same magazine in flat dark earth so as you can also tell I probably wasn't uh, as precise as I probably could have been uh, but it is a little bit time consuming cutting all this out so I just did the best I could uh, with the time I had so I'll be using these magazines in my uh, self-defense, uh, home defense, if you will, AR-15 build. And so, um, yeah, I'm really glad I did this. It creates a lot of extra traction. And the contrast is really good also uh, in terms of just looks. So, yeah, if you ever get oils on your hands or if you start getting real sweaty uh, or, God forbid, you have blood on your hands, uh, it's going to make it a lot easier to uh, do magazine changes. So I also want to just thank everyone for your correspondence in the last uh, video. Um, I received a lot of images and uh, just really good advice. So thank you for that. You guys take care.